moment. They clean the toilets, vacuum the floors, take out the garbage. And at least one worker with 25 years on the job makes a mere $11.50 an hour. Yeah, they are the janitors. And today, the Kansas City Council passed a resolution urging building owners to include paid sick days as a part of an upcoming union contract. Fox 4's Jacob Kittlestad joins us tonight live from City Hall with more on this story tonight. Well, yes, Chris Stell, they are also pushing for higher wages and meaningful benefits, but that paid sick time off those days, that's a major sticking point for these employees that have hygiene in their job description. The Service Employees International Union Local One represents about 1,200 workers in Kansas City, including Sandy Hinson. We're not worried about the heat because we're cool right now. Because we got good stuff coming at us, okay? I do the work that a lot of the young people wouldn't do because it's cleaning bathrooms. <laughs> it's sweeping floors and, and picking up nasty debris off the sidewalk. I remember um, the last past winter, I was the only one, two people there doing everything. Right now, we don't have the full staff that we had before the COVID. She works at Crown Center. She's been there more than 20 years, and the COVID issues she faces are a reality for all the workers here. Not one janitor in Kansas City was able to take a paid sick day, not one. That is criminal, and we got to change it. It is time for us not to just say that we're happy to meet with you. It's time for us to pass ordinances that support you, laws that support you, money that supports you, and a city and a state that supports the resolution approved by the city council supports the union in spirit, but it's certainly no guarantee that demands will be met. If you say, oh, I'm nothing because I do this and I do that, that's not true. You're the best there is. Better pay will help me and also will help my coworkers. I make $11.50 an hour. I've been there for 25 years. So what does that say? Well, Hinson says that she has to sell baked goods on the side to make ends meet. These contract negotiations will be moving forward as the janitor contracts are slated to end in June. Jacob Kittlestat, Fox 4, working for you. For those of you 